under kinematics is loaded a PowerPoint called hip joint kinematics and it deals with just the relationship between displacement or position and velocity. So we're just going to go through that together. So um, the first thing you should do always is write the movements, right? This is the position and so this is we are flexing, we are extending here. We are flexing during, you know, from 40% all the way up, and we are extending, okay? And then we start to think, well, what's happening during each of these movements? Um, well, first of all, we know that when we change direction from flexion to extension, that position velocity is equal to zero. And so you can pick out all the points where velocity is equal to zero. Down here, velocity is equal to zero and up here around 80% velocity is equal to zero. Then we can ask, where would velocity be a maximum? And typically, um, velocity is a maximum at mid-range. So mid-range of this extension phase will have max velocity and mid-range, say, of this flexion phase um, will have max velocity. And so, we're going to pause this video and then do another one looking at the velocity curves and see if that matches up.